Yes, YouTube, but it's Chin Tweezy back with another video. This pair of trainers kind of snuck up on me. I wasn't looking for them or anything like that. And then I saw them popping up on Instagram and saw them on eBay. So the Adidas Treffle upside down, you've got bowling balls. So that's a clue for what this trainer is. It is the Adidas Kegler. Never owned these before. I've only got one pair of Adidas, actually two, but I'm selling the pair at the moment. And these are a size exclusive. They're Kegler Super, I don't know what that says, Summit White, Burgundy, Co Navy, etc. Originals, UK 11, um, usually UK 10 or 10 and a half, but Adidas come up a little bit tight, so you would have to go half a size or size up with Adidas. You can see the box there, the same thing, over with the bowling balls and that. So they're a little bit different from the norm. Most ADAS boxes are blue that I'm aware of and then have white where this is burgundy. So you can see that all over. These are a size exclusive and a really nice pair from what I can tell. This is the first pair of Kegler Supers that I have. I don't know if I'd buy more, but these really grabbed my attention. But also I thought I would snap these up. So I thought I'd get them and see what I like, but I really, really like them. I'm surprised at how much I like them actually. So let's go through the train a little bit. So what you have here is a Kegler Super. You have these plastic things that I think originally should have been pulled out so that you would have got some support, a bit like the air. There would be holes and that would give you sort of cushioning from the running or whatever activity you were doing. They've got Kegler Super, Adidas, and then they've got a really nice gum sole. Pretty straightforward, pretty old school. They've got really nice gum colored suede around the toe box area here and it's decent quality and then they have a good suede here which is grey I haven't said already but they're based on bowling shoes you can see that because of the two different colours so you've got this burgundy colour here and I'm not sure which bits are synthetic and which are real suede but it feels decent quality, it feels decent quality to me so that's burgundy on that side you have this white strip around here and then you have this sort of greyish, slightly off-white, grey I would say, suede there. Then you go on the, the lateral side and you have navy. And then they've got that line down the back, which is mainly burgundy and 79 on the back. So if you put the two trainers together, you get 1979. And I don't know what the reference is. I will look that up or someone put that in the comments, please. Inside. Adidas and then the tongue is a bit like the old school kind of football tongue that you used to get. It's really light. It's not the strongest point but I've never had this trainer before so I don't know how it compares to other versions but yes yeah, it's kind of flimsy almost like the old football boots that I used to remember having. Then you've got the white laces. So for me a really good pickup. I'm really happy with them. I think they're not my usual type of trainer, not that I necessarily have a usual type, but I'm usually a runner's guy. Runners and Jordan 1s. So I didn't expect to like these so much, but I really do. And I'm going to put them on feet so you can get a sense of what they look like. But I think they're that kind of shoe you can wear casually with jeans, trackies. I don't have enough Adidas, so I need some more Adidas for because I have a lot of Adidas track tops. I don't really like to mix up the brand. So... Yeah, great shoe. What do you think? Do you like them? Have you picked them up? Are you a big fan of the Kegler Super? Let me know in the comments. I'll put it on feet, but peace and love. Please subscribe if you like. Give it a thumbs up if you like the video. It's good to sort of reach out to like-minded uh, trainer heads. So peace and love.